Streets of Hope, Bastion Square, one of those little streets of hope right now. This guy takes Visa and MasterCard. Sir, you're an author. How long have you been selling your books here in Bastion Square? 17 years. Now, that's an accent I detect. Now, where are you from, like? <laughs> Try Yorkshire and then every other place in the world, but a long stop in Australia screwed the accent up pretty darn good. <laughs> and so now I've got two mixed together. So you've been traveling the world writing books. Uh, is it because no, you, 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 where, you wrote them all in one place? This place. In this, Victoria? Yes. So is it, what, what made you stay in Victoria? Was it the fact you found the perfect pint? next to the Garrick's Head Pub? No, 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 no. I found the perfect girl. Ah, <laughs> I up. What are your books about? Oh, local history. Now, these guys are famous. These are cruise ship passengers. Where you guys uh, came from? Uh, we come from a little town called Tulare, California, in the Central Valley, in between Fresno and Bakersfield. Very nice. I know exactly where that is. Okay. I know, No, I don't. But anyway, <laughs> what's it been like for you guys walking through Bastion Square? Well, it's been great. We just finished eating this Irish pub right here. And then we met the gentleman right here, who's the author of the books. We were really uh, privileged oh, by right, doing the, that. The Yorkshire lad. Yeah, yeah. So, so we bought books from him, had them signed, and uh, real happy with it. So it's going to be great to take them home and read them. There's more to come from Bastion Square in Victoria, but now a story from the Cowichan Valley. The Blue Grouse Winery's been crushing grapes there for over 25 years. What's the secret to tasty vino? Lisa Pismani talks to the new owners. 